Lady Roselia walk in front of me, right here, right now. From his footprints, I will determine how it'll feel about you. Oh boy. Um, if I said there couldn't be friendship between Pokemon and people, will Roselia's friends understand? But if you meet Ethan and Rosemary, you will understand. Because Ethan and Rosemary are friends. Oh, that's sweet. Fine, that is what your Rosalia thinks of you. Oh, and that's... Shit, it's kind of hard to read with uh, doing two ca like a camera and a screen. I must say, your Rosalia and you share a very close bond. This is for you. Cool! Now to collect a ro uh, collecting fruit print ribbons. This will be easy. Let's see what else we got. My Star Raptor. Okay. Ethan is... Well, how would I want to do his voice? Ethan is... A remarkable human and a trainer. That's why he always performed the best any Star Raptor can possibly do. I attribute that entirely to my partner, Ethan. When I travel, I can see wild Pokemon in, in eye now as enviously. They really need us. That's what your Star Raptor thinks of you. I must say, uh, yeah, this'll be one moment. Okay, back, uh, well, I mean, we're here again still. I just, I just thought it'd be tedious. From its footprints, I will do how do you do that? It's got no footprints. Ethan makes Velma very proud. Best Bequin boasts to friends about Ethan. Ethan and Velma are best of friends. Um, Vespiquin doesn't leave any footprints. Somewhat difficult for me to determine what his thoughts are. However, your Vespiquin and you obviously share a very close bond, so this is for you. Hey, what do you know? Even though you don't have feet, you actually got a footprint ribbon. Isn't that great, Velma? Honey? Honey tits? Yeah. Who's next? Oh shit, I'm sorry. I hope I didn't fuck up the camera. One moment. Okay, let me just... Okay, there we go. Sorry about that. Oh, no, no. oh yeah. Diane. What does she think? Monferno. She'll soon be an Infernape. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, you could say enviously because you know what's going to happen. Oh, yeah, you bet, especially at the beginning. Next. Okay, Shio. Ah, the same. Okay. Finally, we got Roxanne, so what'll happen? Here we go, last one. That Ethan is the, that Ethan is the most impressive of humans. Oh, thank you. It takes a lot. It takes a lot to make me Roxanne sunny and cheerful. Whoa! Uh, wait, what? As a show of affection. I could chomp down on a trainer's neck. Whoa! 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 Fuck! Whoa! Whoa! Shit! Whoa! 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 Holy fuck, Diamond! Whoa! Oh my God! Holy shit! <laughs> Have no fear, I was just merely joking. No, you weren't! No, you weren't! Okay, now I know where I'm gonna- I, I, I now know- I now know what I'm gonna lose my virginity to in this game. Or this life. This one Pokemon life. I know what my trainer is gonna lose, lose his virginity from. Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh my god, Roxanne wants to fuck me. She likes it hardcore. 
Whoa! Holy fuck, biting neck? That's some aggressive sexual idea right there. Jesus! Oh my god! Roxanne! Babe! Timid and pr oh, proud of its power. Oh my fuck. She's really asserting her dominance. She's gonna fuck me. Oh boy. Don't look at me! Ew. Let me demonstrate my technique. This is how grown-ups battle. Lady, I... I... I'm not... <laughs> oh my god. I'm, lady, I'm trying to comprehend that my skunk tank wants to fuck me. Not just that, but in a really aggressive, horny-ass way. She said she wants to bite my neck. She wants to sink her teeth into my neck, probably grabbing me. Probably fucking the shit out of me until we have a dozen children or some shit. Holy fuck, Pokemon. I know I know that you get I know that Pokemon gets uh Oh, you know, like, uh, out of context too easily from time to time. But that, that was way out of fucking context. Way. That is, like, either coincidental or, I don't know. Holy shit. How does it feel to have a Pokemon think of you that way <laughs> oh my god oh buddy how's this gonna fly in the episode she great I have a Pokemon that gets really aroused that's that's grand Dear Journal, I, I think, I think Roxanne's gonna fuck the shit out of me. And we're gonna end up having a huge family. The way she said that she wants to buy my neck, God. Holy fucking A. Where's that berry lady? It's just a guy who I don't care about. Get out of my way, karate ass. Here's where I am standing. Smack dab in the middle of town. You know? I <laughs> look at this guy. I just can't help but I feel like he wants me to shove him in the water. Just push him. Boom. Splash. I don't know why. Oh my god. I still can't believe... <laughs> I've been hanging around all the Sinnoh region. I love planting berries whenever I go. I'll give you a berry too. Please plant it somewhere. I don't feel like planting anything. But thank you anyway. Oh my god. I can't get over that. I'm sorry guys, I can't get over I can't get over how sad <laughs> Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. I can't believe... I can't believe... <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe how sexual that was. Or... How sexual that sounded. Holy shit. Oh, you know what that means? When I pause, I'm gonna doodle probably gonna be worth the hilariousness or hilarity bleh, the hilarity didn't this gym get placed somewhere else in platinum well I already saved what am I doing well I want a badge so let's 
spoil Roselia. Oh, Roselia is getting a wet dream. She's getting what she wants. Okay, where the hell are we? I don't remember if this was actually a maze or not, but hey, kid. My buddy isn't the only thing I work on toughening up here. I also work on my Pokemon, and my spirit, and my inner tube. Wait, that's not a muscle. Whatever. I can dream to be a fucking boyzell one day. Okay, Jackie, calm your tits. Or tits. Oh, shit, I shouldn't have said that to a kid. Did you say a bad word? No, you ju you're just imagining thing, kid. Shut up, I'm gonna kill your boyzell. This will be an easy task. All right. This will be easy, and I'm stretching right now. In case you're wondering why I sound like this right now, ah, uh, my back. Oh, this was easy. This is gonna be a freaking cake. We're gonna get the badge so simple and done. Wow, trainer, you must be tougher than our gym leader. You bet. He's probably only got water Pokemon. You know, he'd probably wish for a water fighting. Okay, what the hell we got? Whoa, that's deep. Where the hell are we? Wait, already? Oh, thank God. Okay. This is gonna be... No, no. Where are the trainers? Really? We're gonna, we're gonna do it this way? Okay, buddy. I have mastery over the incredible power of water. You won't win! Watch me. I've got fishing trophies in my cabinet somewhere. In my box. I have a barboach at it. You and your barboach. Oh, this will be a blast. Well, I made best friends with Rosemary. And she's got something interesting to kill you with. You know, with her using Mega Drain, using all those freaking draining attacks all the damn time, I can't, I can't tell, but I imagine Rosemary's gonna probably be a thick grass Pokemon. Oh, I'm sorry, you wanted to- you wanted me- But the kid always wins anyways, god fucking damn it. I'm so mad I could throw my- <clears throat> My fucking- Here, I have my fishing rod. No, I don't want it. Fuck you then. Okay. Jesus. Fishermen are so pissed. Like golfers. I've traveled all over the globe while raising Pokemon. This is the gem I've chosen. You'll find a handful for sure. Okay, Popeye, what do you got? Binoculars. Okay, Damien. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Not this. Not this. Please suck ass. Oh, great. It had to be a Fucking Wingle. Oh boy. If there's anything that's more annoying, just at the level of a... Uh, of a fucking Zubat or a Tentacool, it has to be a fucking goddamn Wingle. Oh, the hell with that. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna get annoyed by hell by this. This is stupid. I hate Wingles, to be honest. The most goddamn annoying bird Pokemon in existence. I'm serious, everybody can say that. Everyone can agree in this. I'm pretty sure any Pokemon player can agree how annoying Wingle is, how much everyone hates the Pokemon, and that they compare them to the appearance and Encounters of a Zubat and a freaking Tentacool. It's like a- No, actually, it's a combination of both! This is why we hate it. This is why we hate Wingle. It's fucking water and flying! Of course, that makes sense because it's a freaking seagull, but... 
it makes sense because because Zubats are flying and I want to become a strong trainer like Crash Wake. Anyway, because Zubat's flying and Tentacruel is cool as water. So combine those together, they had sex and somehow their baby became a bird. I don't know how. Don't don't ask Pokemon. They come up with some strange bullshit sometimes. But that's how the story goes. And Wingle came born. There we go. And so generation three annoyance. That's how Wingle was made. Cause a zoo bat and a tentacle just fucked and somehow made a bird it for a result. Even though they're not birds. That's the story. Tell that to your parents. Don't actually Wait. I, I honestly don't think come on, I don't think children are gonna watch this. I hope not. I mean that would be really awkward. But <laughs> there you go. Tell that it, it's, it's let's just say it's some strange folklore. Let's call it some strange folklore or some kind of legend or whatever. That's how Wingles are born. Cause we all hate Wingles and they're just as annoying as those two Pokemon. They're the same level. So that's why I came up with the story. Oh my god, you're too much. Shut up and get away with your story. I already get it. I hate Wingle too. Okay, okay, kid. I've landed the most fish Pokemon in the world! I'm next! Who are you? Well, show me what you got. Gosh, they all look pissed off. They all look like they're gonna throw their freaking, uh, fishing rods. Why the bitterness? We're gonna have to heal also, by the way. Not, not yet. Because this is gonna be so easy. Okay? This will be too easy. Of course, we're gonna... We're gonna stop this, uh, one part of the... this episode. Not right now. I mean, I'm, we're not gonna stop there. We're gonna kick, uh... Don't worry, we're gonna kick the gym leader's ass. We're gonna kick the gym leader's ass in the episode. Don't worry. We'll be doing that. Because I know it's going to be easy. And we want to have Pokemon that obey us from level 50. So, yeah. Hey, both intimidating. Okay. It's an intimidation contest. Why don't you shut your fat bubble lip, Gyarados? We know how to own you. Oh, come on, Ethan. Gyarados is pretty awesome. Everybody loves Gyarados. Everyone knows how to defeat Gyarados. You kill it with electric. And a rock. Need I say more? Maybe. But I won't. Gyarados is too predictable and, uh... We all pretty much don't really... I mean, don't get me wrong, Gyarados is cool, but... I, d I don't imagine many of us use a Gyarados in the team, to be honest. Not unless if you're someone who likes the idea of a Mega Gyarados. Could be a different story. Uh, I'll understand that because we love Mega Evolutions, but... I don't, th I don't think most of us... Like, we admire it. You know, it's kind of funny. We admire some Pokemon, but we don't really care for it. Even though we know it has some good uses, but... God damn it, being number one in the world doesn't mean a thing! I'm so mad I can snap my fucking fishing rod! God, you guys have anger problems! Is that everybody? Oh, shit. Where are we? Uh oh, oh, never mind. 
the hell are we? Oh great, I'm trapped. Okay, these buttons are useless. What do I do? There's gotta be some puzzle. Oh, duh. What am I doing? You know what? Never mind. I actually was being stupid. I'm sorry, guys. Let me figure this one out. Oh! What? What's over here? Okay. Oh, one more sailor. Okay, okay. And he's got a blue button there. Like the raging seas, I may crash down and wash away everything before me. That's just how I rolled, kid. Hey, you want a cigarette? Oh, no, I'm good. I'm good. Okay. Well, if you want one... I'm fine, Samson. Okay, I'm just offering. Oh, I had to be a shellos. Oh, well. Who cares? I can kill this. I can kill this easy. I just really wish that Rosemary had a different move other than just constantly... She's gonna be overweight. I bet when she becomes, uh... Roseraid, she's gonna probably be extra thin. Oh. You're lucky you're grass. Otherwise, your ass would be grass. Well, it literally is, but... You know what I mean, Rosemary. Holy shit, that was... That's kind of a relief. If you weren't a grass Pokemon, you'd probably die. Fuck off with Wingle. Come on! Nobody likes Wingles. I get it, you're a sailor, but... Oh, Lord. I just... Whenever I see a Wingle, I just want to grab its freaking breadstick beak and just swing it around and stuff. Some Pokemon can be so annoying that it makes you think bad things. I'll just be honest. And then when you have it in your team and you actually keep it in your team, you don't feel that way to that one. But you're just that way to the rest of the world. I don't know why. It's weird in life. I think we defeated every trainer also, by the way. So anyway, Rosemary. If she evolves into a... Uh, what do you call it? A... Roserade? I bet she's going to be extra freaking thick. Like, we're gonna see... We're probably gonna end up seeing a BBW, uh... Roserade. Like, she's gonna be thick as a milkshake. Okay, okay. Yeah. You're so fantastic, aren't you, Shellis? Not really. You're just slow, and you get screwed over by this. Nice job, Rosemary. You love the buffet here? You gotta taste a little bit of chicken, didn't you? Sea chicken. Chicken of the sea. That would be Wingle. Because it's... Sea poultry. That wave didn't even wash my hands. Did you just masturbate while we were, while we were battling? I'm now become like the waveless sea. Dude, there are kids here. You can't just fucking wank your mushroom in front of the public. I don't want to battle him yet. We'll do that. Don't worry. We'll get there. We'll get there. Just gotta get my ass out of here. He can't even go out there. Can you imagine what it'd be like uh, being stuck in a gym and with a gym leader... It's like after a player does that, what's gonna what's it gonna be like inside of the gym? Do they go like, 
Ah, fuck. How, how do we get out of this one now? Uh... Take five, everyone. Where? We can't go anywhere. This kid fucked up everything. We can't move anywhere. We can't go anywhere. Okay. Okay, okay. I'll kind of think of more about it, the joke. Let's stop right here because it's 25. 